piece of thought, you actually have a superb movie experience on this device. We also have a standard navigation bar at the bottom for making calls, for your contact list, for going into the messaging and also <coughs> the settings. So we have a number of different setting selections here. Each of these lists are actually longer, so they're elasticated lists and you can browse from side to side. Also you can select and move the icons so you can actually ensure that you have the icons you use most on the screen itself. And again within these we actually have elastic lists. So for example you can see the list expands and contracts. Saves moving to another screen. With this we also have a, a multitasking key. So a short press brings you to a, an easy access to which of the screens you want to use. For a longer press, you come to a multitasking page where you can see any of the elements that are running in the background. If something was running in the background, the icon would actually be rotating, so you can actually define which is, which is uh, running in the background. So we also back to the home screen. We also have an element with the FM radio on this device. We also have a built-in FM transmitter. So any music that you have on this device, you can play with any car stereo or home stereo just by using and setting up the FM transmitter. With the gallery, we also have a very clever element. Accelerometer, you can transit through, but also we have a system where we have vertical and horizontal planes within the gallery, so you can actually move through the days pictures that you've taken or change the day and look through the pictures that you've taken on that day. The device actually has a metal casing as well and has a tempered glass front for extra security to make it a very durable device. It comes uh, preloaded with Google Maps.